Hey, welcome to a new video. Since you guys are always asking in the comments for scary videos, we decided to make one again. In today's video, we're going to talk about unexplained events, ghost sightings, and more. If you don't like scary videos, just hide in the comments. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. If you think there's people with superpowers living among us, this next video might be compelling evidence that this is the case. Unfortunately, we couldn't find the original source of the video, but the video footage is said to be from a security camera. It looks like the two men are arguing about something, but what happens next is pretty strange. One man extends his hand, and a few seconds later, he falls to his knees on the ground. It looks like the man is suddenly in pain, but what happens next is beyond comprehension. The creepy man in the suit walks away, but the man on the ground seems to disappear in a pile of dust. I have no idea if this is real or if it was staged, but it's very strange. In February of 2013, a video was uploaded by Meta Addison in which we hear a creepy sound coming from the forest. No one knew if this sound came from a creature or maybe a witch was flying around. Listen for yourself. The video is said to have been recorded somewhere in the Umatia Reservation, an area that extends to the northeast of the Blue Mountains mountain range in Oregon, USA. It would not have been the first time a similar sound has been captured on camera in this area. The 1,500 people who live there report often hearing terrifying sounds at night. One anonymous man says his dog has even become afraid to go outside. People in the comments think it might be foxes, while others say it might be a skinwalker, which is a creature that can turn itself from a witch into an animal. The following story comes from a Reddit user named Sir Squid, in which he claims that when he's in bed at night, he regularly hears footsteps on the first floor. Every time he decides to take a look downstairs, he finds a number of items that have fallen off the cupboard. At first, he didn't think anything of it, but after this happened more and more often, he decided to put down a camera. What he found the following week was quite scary. The man's favorite chair standing in the living room started rocking back and forth out of nowhere, but the camera would capture even more ghostly activity. After a while, in fact, items from the cupboard fall onto the carpet. The reactions of the people on Reddit vary quite a bit. Some believe that a fan is causing the chair to move, while others believe that this is actually the work of a ghost. In the following video, we see a man named Resurrect who explores the creepy abandoned DeSoto mine somewhere in the American state of Arizona. The man and his stepfather love to go on many adventures, but what they encountered here gave them chills. The man tells that they were the only ones in the cave, and he got the feeling as if something had happened here before. Anyway, this is what they heard. As you heard, it seemed like someone was walking on a wooden floor. This is very strange. Right after this happened, his stepfather said that he had trouble breathing as well, and his flashlight went on and off. Someone in the comments thinks this might be water droplets, while others were convinced that there was a ghost haunting the place. According to legend, one day in the 2000s, a man named Jose from Fresno, California was awakened by his dogs barking crazily. He is said to have been the first person to capture mysterious figures on camera known as the Fresno Nightcrawlers. Now someone on Reddit has experienced a similar moment when he saw a translucent figure walking past his house on his security camera. In this next video that appears to be from 2015, we see a man walking past a parked car in an alley. But what happens next is pretty inexplicable. In fact, if you look closely, a shadowy girl appears right behind the car. Some people in the comments claim that this must have been a ghost. The man walking to the scooter doesn't seem to notice anything, and neither does the man walking by. There's little information available about the video, but there's a creepy legend from Taiwan about a girl in a red dress who was chasing a family in the mountains. Could the girl in this video be the same girl from the legend? How else could we explain what we see here on camera? Everyone loves going to a restaurant to eat, but what if you suddenly see a piece of meat rise up from the plate and jump off the table as if it's possessed? This video was shot somewhere in a Japanese restaurant. The video footage shows pieces of raw meat lying on a plate and suddenly starting to move. The internet also called this piece of meat the zombie chicken. Some people present in the restaurant started screaming out of fear. It's said that this was possibly caused by sauce being put on the meat that caused the muscle tissue to start contracting. Whatever it was, I think the person sitting at the table immediately lost their appetite for food. What would you do if you saw your food suddenly move? Let me know in the comments. 
This group of teenagers were filming a scene at their university when something happened that freaked them all out. Even after studying by a lot of people on the internet, it still remains a mystery. As we see, a door mysteriously opens, and when zooming in, you'd swear you saw a white figure ducking away. But who opened that door? The following video of a supposed spirit's the following video of a supposed spirit sighting is said to be from the Philippines. Unfortunately, I couldn't find the original video, so I have no idea if this clip is real or not. When we analyze the video, we see someone approaching who appears to be going through a locked gate. It's difficult to see, but many people immediately believe that this was a ghost. Because how else could it be explained that this figure is walking through the closed gate? Several people say that it's possible that the figure climbed over the gate, but it's hard to see because the video is in poor quality. At one point, the figure approaches the camera and we can see that it's possibly a man wearing shorts. However, it remains unexplained how he managed to walk through the gate. What do you think's going on here? Let me know in the comments. There's a good chance you may have had a doll as a toy in your childhood. As you get older, these dolls can get kind of creepy because they just stare at you and they just stand still. Or do they? There's hundreds of stories and even videos on the internet of dolls that started moving from out of nowhere. A YouTuber named Spooky Lynx thought it was a good idea to buy a spooky doll from the internet. The following days, he filmed all the events. When he's gaming with his friend, you can see the doll slowly move forward, but the creepiest part is when he hung the doll in the hallway near his bedroom. The hand of the doll moves upwards in a very realistic way. I have no idea how this can be explained. What do you think? This particular road in Bangalore, India is notorious for the number of accidents that happen there. Not surprisingly, from time to time, inexplicable things are captured on camera. In this video, we see a ghost wandering in the middle of the road as several cars pass by. Pretty creepy if you ask me. Could this be a spirit of a deceased person? There's a story circulating in Japan that cab drivers pick up ghost passengers from time to time. In this video, we can clearly see that no one has entered the vehicle, but we do see a shadowy figure in a hooded coat sitting there. Then, he disappears, only to reappear a few seconds later. This kind of scary situation has become a bit of a habit in Japan. Some people say it started after an earthquake and tsunami that devastated large parts of Japan in 2011. Many people believe that these ghost passengers were victims of that tragedy. At least seven drivers have admitted to experiencing strange happenings in their cabs as well. One of the spooky stories going around is of a cab driver who picked up a girl and asked where she wanted to go. The girl said she wanted to be taken to a place that was completely in ruins at the time to visit her family. But before the man could answer, the girl would have disappeared from his car. Pretty bizarre. Imagine you look out your window and suddenly see a creepy figure climbing a wall on all fours. You might think that this is a spider woman, or maybe it's a ghost. This creepy footage went viral on YouTube and all sorts of other social media platforms a few years ago. It was reportedly captured on camera somewhere near a hospital in India. According to local people, similar figures were said to have been observed often. However, the question is why this figure climbs the wall so easily, and why those dressed in white. Some people think it's a woman sleepwalking, although others believe it's a terrifying spirit. There's also those who believe it's a jinn, a supernatural creature from Arabic mythology. The Battle of Gettysburg is known as one of the greatest battles of the American Civil War. Since then, several sightings and appearances of ghosts and other paranormal things have been seen there. In this video, someone claims to have captured two ghosts with his camera. People who have visited Gettysburg regularly report feeling cold on hot summer days and often feeling an invisible presence around them. The Clown Motel was founded in 1985 and is located in Tonopah, a small town in the US state of Nevada. As the name suggests, the motel is full of clown-like dolls. There are said to be over 2,000 of them, and one of them is not only the biggest, but also the scariest. Many employees who work at the motel claim to have seen the clown move. Near the motel, there's an old cemetery that was created in the 1900s to bury more than 300 people that reportedly got killed by the mysterious Tonopah Plague. It's thus thought that the evil spirits moved into the motel to scare the visitors. Stories also circulate that room keys disappear, and that at night, voices can be heard. The YouTube channel Paranormal Voyages decided to stay at the motel for a few nights and tried to communicate with the clown to make a move. However, very little happened that night. But once they were packing everything up, the only camera left on caught this. You know what? I don't have a connection. I don't have a his hand just moved. Everyone is shocked that the clown just moved his hand, but this wasn't all. Because look what happens next. It's down. It just moved. I just watched. Whoa. Whoa. 
Oh, hands fell. Could this be proof that the clown is paranormal after all? What do you think? In this video uploaded by the YouTube user Dear Roman in 2017, we see a woman flying over a river via a zipline. This isn't just any river, it would be full of giant crocodiles. I have no idea why it was decided to hang a zipline here. Fortunately, the woman was well attached, but what if something goes wrong and she falls down? The zipline doesn't seem too safe to me. Anyway, at some point you see a huge crocodile jumping out of the water. The crocodile probably wanted a tasty snack, but fortunately the zip line was high enough and she retracted her legs so the crocodile couldn't reach her. Still, I would never dare to go on a zip line like this that's full of crocodiles. Would you dare? Let me know in the comments. On a sunny day, this couple decided to camp somewhere and passed by an abandoned cabin. If you look closely, you can see the additional person can be seen in the cabin behind the girl. This video footage was taken at a state park in Florida. And while the girl was leaning out the open window, something walked behind her. The couple decided to investigate the cabin, but could not find a thing. The figure also quickly disappears from the scene, looking pale and ghostly. Pretty creepy, don't you think? What this man does in the following video will definitely scare the crap out of you. The video comes from a Thai YouTube channel that tells spooky bedtime stories. In this clip, the man suddenly reaches out his hand to grab a bottle of water. All of this was reportedly captured on a surveillance camera. But this isn't all. He sometimes looks at the camera with a creepy expression, and here we see something creepy happen again as he goes to bed. I have no idea if this is staged or if it's actually paranormal, but a pair of hands appearing at the side of the bed looks pretty realistic. Imagine if you were grabbed by your feet at night while you slept. Creepy. The Angry Grandpa Show was a YouTube channel that was very popular and allowed a look into the life of an angry grandfather. In one of the videos that was uploaded in October of 2011, he's sitting outside on a bench and is asked what he thinks of camping. At the end of the video, we see a head appearing behind the trash can. Nothing was said about this in the video itself, so the comments are full of people wondering what kind of figure was hiding behind the trash can. The figure has black hair, black eyes, and a gray face. Most people believe that this was the head of a spirit child who showed himself. What makes this event even stranger is that the figure was never even spoken of. So we can only speculate what we see. What do you think? This is another one of those incidents where people go looking for the supernatural, and when you do that at night, you sometimes find or hear something. A man had heard about several reported ghost sightings in the forest near his home, and decided to take a look on his own. At one point, he comes across a figure that looks like a woman with a bowed head, but then disappears again. Because it looks so believable, many people in the comments had told him not to go back to this place. The men from the YouTube channel Exploring Abandoned Mines were in Mexico in February of 2019, investigating a 168-foot deep abandoned mine. After one of them decides to go down through a mine shaft, at some point, the rope starts to get tangled. From the sound of his voice, he begins to find it very scary. Oh, they're going down fast. <sighs> if this isn't scary enough, at a depth of 125 meters, he suddenly hears a sound of a voice saying, oh, and then a strange hissing sound. What was that? Many people in the comments are discussing what this could have been. Some think this was the sound of the rope scraping along the rock face, while others think that it was an animal or even a ghost. What do you think it could have been? Let me know in the comments. This next video was filmed by a Russian YouTuber called Tret in September 2016. The description states that he discovered an unknown creature in a Russian forest and that he captured it with his smartphone camera. As you can see, at one point he stumbles into a hole in the ground, which has been boarded up with the wooden planks. When he takes a look at what is hiding there, he suddenly sees a strange creature with blue eyes. The video has 2,300 likes with only 70 dislikes, which in my opinion shows that it might be real. If the video was fake, it probably would have gotten a lot more dislikes. What this creature could have been, I have no clue. I'll leave that up to you to decide. Maybe it was a ghost sighting, an animal that we can't see in the dark, or just an inexplicable creature. This video footage is of a plain corridor in Phuket, Thailand. As seen on camera, we see shadows and figures moving slowly down the corridor, which would be normal if the airport wasn't deserted and if a plane was nearby. The footbridge also seems to be connected to nothing. Where do these ghost passengers come from? What do you think? This next video was shot in 2011 somewhere in Russia. A group of friends were having fun in what appeared to be a muddy field when they found this small hole in the ground. 
They were sitting there looking at it for a while and suddenly came up with a bold idea. I don't know why, but one of the boys decided to dive into the muddy hole and he was completely swallowed by the ground. But the question is, what is the hole and how deep can it be? And what happened to the boy and where did he go? If we continue watching the video, we see that a second boy jumps into the hole followed by a third person. Because the video was interrupted, it was not known what happened next. But some people think that the area must be a swamp created on a layer of leaves, and so that explains how the three boys fit into the hole. But where would they have ended up? What do you think? A group of friends came home from a nice hike in the mountains, and when they decided to watch the video footage back, they saw something terrifying. They were in the mountains of Talang on the island of Sumatra in Indonesia, and seemed to be followed by a mysterious figure. The group of friends claim they didn't know the figure and believe it could be a demon or a spirit of a woman who got lost on the mountain. The more you look, the creepier it gets, as the woman appears to have a pale face with black eyes and white hands. People in the comments claim that the figure was trying to communicate with them. Unfortunately, there's no more information about the truth of this video, but it has certainly scared the hell out of many people. In this video, a security camera turned on in the middle of the night after something moved in the woods near the house. This camera caught something that the naked eye would have never have seen. Even if you were standing right next to it in the backyard, if you look closely, you can see a white shadow passing by in the video until it disappears into the woods on the right. When I came across the following picture of a creepy creature with long arms and a little white-like face, I thought this was pretty creepy. So I went to investigate and found the video where we see the creature walking down the street. Fortunately, this is not a real creature, but a costume that was made by the YouTube channel General Tampon. This costume was supposedly made specifically for Halloween to scare the crap out of people. It's said to be inspired from the creatures called the Landstriders from the 1982 fantasy film The Dark Crystal. In this video, they go to the streets to scare people and they did quite a good job. Just imagine if you came across this thing at night. Exercising and training your body is always good for your health, but if we're to believe this video, some ghosts also like to do it. The video was uploaded in January of 2020 on Mohamed Soleimane's Facebook page. We see an outdoor area with some fitness equipment. It's quite dark outside and Mohamed seems to be the only person around. When he sees the fitness machine moving, he decides to grab his phone to film it. Because the device moves up and down, it doesn't seem to me that this is done by a rope. But there's no one around the thing. So how is this possible? Some believe it was a Dijin. Dijins are invisible and powerful ghosts or demons from the Arabic folklore. I myself have no idea what this could have been. If you have any ideas, then let me know in the comments. Children are known for always being very honest, and it's said that sometimes they see paranormal things that adults can't see. So, also in this video, in which two children are playing, one of them sees something in the dark corner. The other girl also felt a presence behind her and spontaneously started crying. Whatever they saw scared them so much that they decided to run away. Could these girls have actually seen a ghost, or what else could it have been? On August 10th, 2020, the United States had one of the strongest thunderstorms in its history. It's also called one of the most expensive thunderstorms, as the damages caused by the storm was 11.5 billion US dollars. In this video, we see how the Dureko storm destroyed Cedar Rapids in Iowa. A Dureko storm is a fast-moving thunderstorm that moves along a relatively straight path. So this video shows how the weather changed dramatically in just 30 minutes. In the first few minutes, it's a normal windy day. But as the video progresses, the wind gust increases and halfway through, we see trees swaying back and forth and even breaking off. According to official statistics, approximately 4.4 million trees were destroyed throughout Iowa. By the end of the video, the houses across the street no longer were visible either. Everyone's heard of ghost possession and objects that start moving out of nowhere, but have you ever heard of a table that can walk by itself? The following video is said to be from Sri Lanka, where we see a table with three legs, and according to local people, the table is possessed. The table with three legs is called a kanapua, and according to them, it's said to have magical powers. Some of the people walking along keep a special kind of herbs and incense around the table. Although little is known about this event, the ritual is taken very seriously in Sri Lanka. According to them, the possessed object may lead to the house of someone who has done something bad in their life, so that this person can finally pay for their deeds. Do you believe this? Let me know in the comments. 30 East Drive Pontefract is the address that everyone in the United Kingdom knows, because this is the most haunted house in England, built in the 1950s. Inside the house haunts an entity known as the Block Monk, the Pontefract Poltergeist, or simply as Fred. 
Fred is considered one of the most violent poltergeists in Europe. In this video, we see the ghost throwing a baby carriage down the stairs. If you see this, I don't think you would want to stay in this house. This next YouTuber is from Jordan, a country in the Middle East, and he's known for the abandoned places he explores. In a video he uploaded in June of 2019, he explores an old building somewhere underground after hearing that paranormal things happen there. There is said to be a djinn hanging around in the building. A djinn, according to the Quran, is a supernatural invisible being that can take form of a human being. After a while of walking around, he begins to look faster and faster in the abandoned rooms because he has the feeling that he's being followed. And his feeling is right, because when he's in one of the rooms with a mirror on the wall, he suddenly sees something behind him. As soon as this happens, he says some Arabic words that make the djinn disappear again and leave him alone. Definitely a very creepy experience, if you ask me. During a broadcast in May of 2020, Pope Francis gave a speech somewhere in Vatican City near a window of a building on the top floor. The Pope is the head of the Catholic Church and the Bishop of Rome, and has both political and religious duties. So when he gave a live speech on television, something strange happened. After the Pope did his speech, he stepped back inside and disappeared from out of nowhere. The uploader says that the government would have tried to remove all footage of this event from the internet. The most explainable reason would be that the Pope was a hologram. A hologram is a technology to turn a person into a three-dimensional image in the form of a film or sensor. In 2014, they had made a hologram version of Tupac performing at the Coachella Music Festival. However, there were no statements made that they would use holograms of the Pope, so this moment remains very creepy and unanswered. The next time you walk your dog in the middle of the night, be on guard. It was the dog that first noticed something was wrong by reacting strangely to the trees. Animals like cats and dogs are said to have a sixth sense for things that are invisible to human eyes. And the girl in this video didn't notice or see the figure standing among the trees and staring directly at her. There's been a whole bunch of UFO sightings over the years. Although some can be described as weather phenomena, there is a small percentage that remain unexplained. For example, in 2020, there was a sighting of a glowing object hovering over the Hugh Titan Canyon forest in Guadalajara, Mexico. But that's not the first time that someone saw a UFO in Guadalajara. Because in 2012, in the middle of a nighttime storm, some people captured on camera something that looked like an alien spacecraft. Could these really be UFOs? At first, only a group of lights are visible moving, and then the sky is lit up by lightning, and we see it more clearly, followed by another lightning bolt. But this time, we seem to see a huge spaceship. Do you believe in UFOs and aliens? Or what else do you think could have caused this? Let me know in the comments. You've probably heard about the creepy story of Bloody Mary, in which you have to call out her name three times in front of the mirror for her to appear. Whether this is real or just a legend, I have no clue. But in the following video originating from Japan, we see a girl standing in front of the mirror. Not much happens at first, but suddenly her reflection seems to turn itself around. Many people in the comments say that they couldn't sleep for days after seeing the footage. Others think that the video is fake, but that doesn't make it any less creepy. Some people say that it would have been harder to fake the video because it would have been shot decades ago. What do you think? Have you ever wondered how many ghosts lurk over our shoulders? If this next video is to be believed, a ghost even goes along in a cab. The video footage comes from a CCTV camera in Japan and follows a man getting into a yellow cab. Only he doesn't get in, but floats in. Could this be proof that ghosts really exist after all? The following video was uploaded by a Facebook user called Shy Unique Legacy and is set near a remote forest in the US state of Florida. When the person was live streaming on Facebook, she noticed strange movements outside at some point near the trees. After a while, she tries to give herself some courage and decides to open the door to take a look. What she saw was quite scary and inexplicable. As you see, she ran inside as soon as she saw a large and translucent figure floating by. According to many people, this is one of the most believable moments of a spirit being captured on camera. The fact that it was a live stream and not just a video makes it a lot creepier. What do you think that was? Let me know in the comments. A YouTuber named Richard205 Maria uploaded a video on September 2013, in which he claims to have captured some kind of a white-like demon or creature on camera in his backyard. He had noticed it in the past, so he decided to install a camera in the hopes that one day he could capture it on camera. If we play the footage in slow motion, we see a white thing flying upwards. If you play it in real time, this creature is very fast, and you can hardly see it. Some think it was a human form of a ball of light, while others say it looks more like an angel. 
In any case, it seems that most people in the comments agree that it's something that's not from this world. Critics would rather say that it's graded on a computer with digital animation. Unfortunately, we'll probably never know, so we can only guess what it could have been. Welcome to the Molly Stark Sanatorium, a former tuberculosis hospital in Stark County. This place is a hotspot for both ghosts and the paranormal. In this video, someone decided to visit the tunnel and declared to hear strange footsteps. Moments later, he even saw a figure that appeared to be wearing a lab coat. The following video comes from the YouTube channel Mindseed TV, who is known for exploring haunted locations. In one of the videos, they tried to investigate a mysterious whisper in a cave. When they heard the strange sound, they tried to convince themselves that it was just the wind blowing into a narrow opening at the end of the cave. But according to them, the wind can't make whisper-like sounds. Listen for yourself. Shh. What is that? They were not deterred by the scary sound and investigated the cave further. At one point, the whispering sound seemed to come from everywhere, even from behind them. Unfortunately, we don't know what the sound was, as they decided to leave the cave immediately after this. Normally, there's nothing creepy about a supermarket, but what we see in the following video footage, people don't really have an answer for. A supermarket employee named Elise tried to stand on a crate to fill the upper shelves, but the crate is inexplicably pushed away by an invisible force, causing Elise to fall to the ground. Her colleague looks shocked and wonders what happened. The owner of the supermarket says that a ghost named Stacy is said to be haunting the place. Fortunately, Elise was fine, but the question of how the crate suddenly moved still remains a big mystery. One Halloween night, high school students wore creepy skeletal clothing and makeup at a local soccer game. Little did they know that a real ghost was running by. And this was not the first time. People at Somar High School are aware of this ghost. This time, however, a mother was lucky enough to accidentally capture the ghost on camera during a game. A Reddit user named MRB99 uploaded a video in January of 2020, in which his Tesla car sensor picked up something strange. He was sitting with his daughter in a Tesla Model 3, and when he planned to park his car in the garage, the camera caught a dark figure standing in front of his car when it was not. Several people in the comments believe that this was a software glitch, while others believe it was possible that the sensors can pick up ghosts. In any case, his daughter was very shocked by it. A few days later, he tells the Reddit post that he has not been able to capture any similar moments since. So what was this, a glitch or a ghost? What do you think? In the following video, we see a man standing somewhere near a train station with his hands in his pockets and with his headphones on his head listening to some music. At a certain moment, a woman walks up with a skateboard and a spray can. She seems to be keeping an eye on the man and eventually goes over there and sprays something on the back of his jacket. Unfortunately, I can't show exactly what she sprays on his jacket, but I can tell you that it starts with the letter P. While she's doing this, the man doesn't seem to notice at all. I don't know what the intention of this was, but it's very embarrassing for the man if other people would see what was sprayed on his back. A bit later, we see her waving her skateboard around. So what the intention of the woman was is not entirely clear, but she seems to enjoy it. It looks like she knows she's being filmed, which makes it a lot more creepy. During the day, school cafeterias are filled with noisy students, but what actually happens at night? In this next video, the school cafeteria seems to be haunted, as if you feel like you shouldn't be there. At one point, you see a shadowy figure appear, almost as if it emerges from the ground and then passes through the deserted space. One day, the residents of Coffee County, Alabama were harassed by an unidentified creature that inhabited the woods. Concerns grew day by day, and the mystery even caught the attention of news media. According to local reports, people could hear loud screams in the evening. They were sure it wasn't a coyote, nor any other animal that they're used to seeing in the woods. However, when experts went to look, they found something unusual. This happened in 2020, and to this day, the creature has still not been identified. Some people think this could be the legendary Bigfoot or a skunk ape. This next person was walking around in the woods at night, and when he went back to his car, something creepy happened. In fact, he felt that something was chasing him in the woods. And when he wanted to start the car to drive away, we see something creepy appear in the car window. Fortunately, the window was closed. How fast would you have stepped on the gas pedal? Do you ever hear strange noises coming from the attic at night and decide to quickly crawl under the covers? The next person in this video also heard strange noises coming from the attic, and he felt like it was coming from behind the radiator. When he decided to take a look, he didn't see anything at first. 
but when he looked again, he suddenly saw an eye looking back at him. Pretty creepy if you ask me. I hate to think of someone watching you in your own home at night. Let's hope this video isn't real, although I couldn't figure this out, so who knows. Could this eye be from a creature or could it be a neighbor? What do you think? The woman in this video is reportedly being stalked by a child ghost and even experimented with leaving toys on the porch of her cabin in Colorado, USA. When a camera recorded the night's events, it proved her theory correct. The voice outside wasn't just in her head. When you see it, you see what looks like a little spirit of a child running away. Pretty creepy. When I came across the following photo on the internet of a figure with long fingers, I thought the figure in itself was creepy enough. But the photo is from a video on Danny Donahue's YouTube channel. In the video, we see a woman walking to her car, who at one point encounters the figure on a street corner, and continues to stare at her as it tries to hide its fingers. If I had encountered such a figure, I would have definitely just run away. When the woman is in her car, the figure seems to walk past her when she's not paying attention for a moment. Fortunately, it turned out to be only a short horror film created by a talented filmmaker. Still, I thought this deserved a place on this list because the figure looked pretty creepy. The following video is not so much about ghosts or creatures, but it's pretty scary when you think about it. We see an airplane flying close to another airplane. I have no idea to what extent this clip is real, but the plane that we see being filmed seems to be from an airline Air Canada Road. If we look closely, even the pilots are sitting in the cockpit and their facial expressions don't really say much. It doesn't look like there's any panic. The video might have been edited, but it looks pretty realistic. But why the two planes flew so close to each other, I have no idea. But this seems pretty frightening to me. I don't want to think about looking out the window and suddenly seeing another plane flying next to you. Have you ever heard of shadow people? They're said to inhabit the corners of rooms, invisible and silent until you notice them. It's believed that such an occurrence is captured on camera, although the man has not yet seen the extra presence. Imagine if you look back at the camera footage and see a shadow person lurking behind you. Pretty creepy. Imagine sitting and eating at a fancy restaurant, and after you're done, you decide to order some more food. That's what the woman in this video decided to do, but a few seconds after she gets up, her chair suddenly slides back, and other things on the table start moving as well. The manager of the restaurant said that everyone was shocked after seeing the video footage, and have no idea how this could have happened. People who believe in paranormal activities think it was a poltergeist, while others are still skeptical. The reason for this is because nothing happened at the rest of the tables. However, the video claims that the events are real, and that this is not the first time unexplained things happened at this restaurant. In the following video, the people from the YouTube channel Ogden Paranormal Investigations go to the most haunted hospital in the American state of Utah. This hospital is called Asylum 49, and was officially opened in 1953. Because the hospital didn't have enough money, they had to throw all the deceased into the same room. According to the story, there's a ghost of a nurse walking around in the building, and there's said to be a man and a little ghost girl who walk down the hall at night, giggling. Nowadays, the hospital has become a haunted house where people claim to have experienced strange things. In the video, they regularly catch orbs in different rooms, and mainly in the old operating room. But the scariest part is when they enter one of the rooms where there's a creepy mannequin. When we look on the left side of the room, we see something at the window that disappears as soon as the camera moves towards it. The people from the YouTube channel suggest that this may have been a ghost sighting. A surveillance camera captured the moment a translucent figure appeared out of nowhere. The only living soul nearby was a poor cow, who knew nothing of evil spirits that manifested next to it. What do you think the spirit was doing here? If you watch a lot of scary videos, you must have heard of Slenderman, a fictional character who had become a creepypasta in 2009. However, some people claim to have seen Slenderman in real life. So did two guys from the YouTube channel Shimmy Jim Hogg. The video was uploaded in November of 2013, and we first see a memorial stone with multiple holes in it indicating a cross. Why there are holes in it, I don't know, but the two boys are all alone at a cemetery when they see in the distance a whitish man standing in a suit. The creepy thing about this is that it looks like the man doesn't have a face. He's also staring at the boys, but they decide to walk towards him. Just after that, the video seems to end abruptly. So what happens next, I don't know, but some claim that this was Slenderman. What do you think? The United Kingdom has a haunted hotspot that is very active. Cameras have reportedly caught a glow in the shape of a human slowly wandering through this area. It's believed that the ghost's identity is the 7th Earl of Sefton, Hugh William Osbert Molyneux. This man lived in the house until his death in 1972. 
A car was almost at the end of the Ocean Avenue Bridge in Palm Beach, Florida, when for some reason the man decided to stop. But why is he stopping the car at this exact spot? Seconds later, the bridge begins to open, causing the driver to panic and open his door. But what's the man's reasons for why he did this? Fortunately, nothing serious happened and the bridge only pushed the car forward, at which point the man drives off again. It turns out that the bridge operator hadn't seen the car when he opened the bridge. But the authorities did not accept this excuse, which resulted in the resignation of the bridge operator. Do you think the fault lays on the bridge operator or the man who stopped the car? Let me know in the comments. What has been the scariest moment in your life, and what did you do in that situation? Let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.